are many stories of mythical creatures who would bring doom upon people and terrorize people, often in the shape of beautiful, beautiful creatures. And we see it in ancient Greek mythology and uh, Roman and Norse and uh, plenty of others that I can't name right now. Um, and we have it here too in, in our Celtic uh, mythology and in Donegal mythology with silkies. Now silkies were these beautiful maidens, sea creatures, shapeshifters if you like, who would lure men with their charm and uh, their deep brown eyes uh, lure them to their death and uh, made them irresistible. And this is what this bottle is, uh, by extension. Uh, proposing to the potential purchaser that, yes, this will be irresistible to you. So this is produced by the Sleeve League uh, Distillery. Um, they, at the moment, produce uh, Duleman, Duleman Gin, which I must say looks very nice. Maritime Gin. So they produce that at the moment, and they have plans to build a distillery of their own and produce single malts. And at the moment they've commissioned this. It's a blend of Irish whiskies to do us in the meantime until they build the distillery. Uh, so it just looks uh, very inviting. It's a nice colour. It's uh, capped off at 40%. So I think we should uh, dive right in. Uh, it does say that it's matured in oak casks. Very traditional stuff. We don't know the Irish whiskies involved, so we just have to make assumptions about that. Nice quality cook there. Got a nice sweet character to it. Hmm, very sweet. Very pleasant. Light vanilla bourbon notes. Unusual since it wasn't in a bourbon cask. It's light and crisp. Very subtle. Mouthfeel is nice and smooth. Nice and elegant, yeah. Very crisp. Palette cleansing, I would say. Citrusy as well, but with nice background vanilla, vanilla notes too. Um, and it has legs. It has legs, which is nice to see. Mm, very clean cut, very nice. I would describe this as uh, a summertime malt, actually. Summertime whiskey. It's a beautiful day here in Donegal. Um, it must be about 19 degrees, which, believe me, it is rare in Ireland sometimes to get that kind of good weather. Mm. Very nice. It does sort of run off. Um, it's fairly abrupt at the end, but it is nice. It's pleasing. It's all rounded. Um, very refreshing and zingy. Zinginess to it, which I really like. So that's it, that's, that's the Silky, um, and I really hope that they, they get to build this very soon, this, this building here, and start producing uh, their own single malts in this League League Distillery. It'll be very exciting to see. But uh, overall, what I think of Silky is it's, it's, a, very ple it's a crowd pleaser, uh, it's inoffensive and nicely rounded, it's got a uh, very nice little... Uh, uh, citrusy kind of little notes, some little peaky, uh, uh, bite, little bitey notes, little spicy notes, uh, which they attribute to ginger. I would say I would agree with that. I want to say a big thank you to Moira and James for uh, for hooking me up with this and giving me a chance to uh, to sample this as well. Um, I believe they're in China at the moment, uh, rather Hong Kong, I should say, Hong Kong. Uh, promoting Silky, promoting the distillery and their and their future opportunities. 
and I'm sure they'll do very well out of it. Uh, you can find this on Master of Malt and anywhere you can get good whiskey. So grab a hold of it and check it out. It's um, a really nice smooth um, finish, um, really nicely blended. I'd love to know actually what is in it, but for now, the Silkies lips are sealed. Mm -hmm.